Hi there guys, Gentle Pet here, and today I'm going to show you some chemistry 101. It's going to be how to make super fertilizer, right? So see this little sapling? I'm just going to right click on it and boom! Every time, every time, every time it's, it grows. Okay, it's really small because it's underneath another one, but still, it's super awesome because super fertilizer rocks. So let's go to the chemistry lab and see how to make this. All right, so to make super fertilizer, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use ammonia and combine it with phosphorus, and that's gonna grow the plants and like we showed you earlier. All right, so ammonia is made out of nitrogen and hydrogen three. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is go to element constructor and we're gonna go seven protons and seven electrons and then seven neutrons. And you see right there, we have this nitrogen or you can do eight and just so you know the atomic weight for nitrogen is 14 well we'll, we'll get 64 that should be enough right and now we're just going to reset the element constructor and we're going to go one proton one electron and if you see it automatically does it because there's no neutrons the atomic weight is one but if you want to you can actually add a neutron or two neutrons but still, uh, zero is what we're gonna go with. Let's go ahead and get 64 of those, just so we have enough. Nitrogen and hydrogen, we have that, that's what we need. So we can exit out of here, and we're gonna go over to the compound creator. All right, so we're gonna put one nitrogen and then three hydrogen, and then we have an ammonia. Uh, just for demonstration purposes, I'm grabbing a lot of these guys. Uh, really, you just need one of these for the compound we're making. So I just grabbed a bunch of them, just so I have extra. All right, so now we're going to go back over here to the element constructor. All right, and we're going to need phosphorus now, and that's going to be 15 protons, 15 electrons, and 16 neutrons, and there it is, phosphorus. All right, and that has an atomic weight of 31. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to go ahead and pull this on the 17. All right, so now we're going to go over to the lab table, and we're going to put in one ammonia and then one phosphorus, and then combine it. And you see what it popped out? And there's our super fertilizer. All right, so let's do a jungle sapling first because it's right there. All right, so let's try it out. And it should just take one hit. Boom, there it is. And that's a full, well, it's not full. That's kind of randomized, but that's a good size jungle tree. And I guess uh, it only gives you one at a time. But let's go ahead and uh, look at the dark oak saplings. Uh, can we do that? Uh, let's move over here for that. All right, dark oak again, you need four. All right, let's go ahead and super fertilize this. Boom. All right, so we have a dark oak tree now. And then uh, come over here. Let's go ahead and just do a uh, spruce real quick and use a super fertilizer on it. Bam. So everything that you want to use it on, it's just going to be a one hit uh, birch real quick. Boom. All right, and let's try it on this too. Yeah, that works also. Wow, that's crazy. So this works on everything. It won't go higher than three, of course. But it looks like it works on anything that grows. That's really awesome. Let's try it on the cactus real fast just to see. And it should, but let's try it anyways. Nope, it does not work on cactus. Okay, so everything except cacti. So anyways, guys, uh, if you want to see some more of these Chemistry 101s, let me know in the comments. Make sure to smash that like button if you liked the video. And thanks for watching, you guys. Y'all have a good day, and I will talk to you later. Skizzle!